Hi, today we are going to talk about how different weather conditions affect our flight. Temperature is one of the factors that affect uh, the performance of the aircraft uh, in flight. High temperature will reduce uh, the performance of uh, the aircraft, so they are inversely proportional. Let me give you an example of taking off. When we have a high temperature during takeoff, the temperature will affect uh, the density. The density is uh, the column of air that will be taken by the engine. So if uh, we have high temperature, there will be less and less air that will be sucked into the engine and that will uh, reduce the performance of uh, our engine. So that reduction will uh, cause the takeoff run to be long and uh, the climb performance will be low. Even our crews will take uh, too much time to reach to our destination than if uh, we have a low temperature. In, in the morning, temperatures are usually low. That's why most of the students are given their solos in the morning since the aircraft performs better, we have high density and the performance is at the top. Winds is another factor. We have a wind component and we have a wind velocity. Wind, uh, let me start with a wind uh, velocity. Wind velocity is given in two groups. We have uh, the wind direction and we have uh, the wind speed. The wind uh, components, we have the tailwind, the headwind, and we have the crosswind. The headwinds affect our ground speed. The headwind will decrease our ground speed. The tailwind will increase the ground speed. And uh, the crosswind will affect the direction. If uh, ATC, if the controller gives you a wind direction of uh, 050, this is the direction of uh, 050 relative to the, to the nose of the aircraft. And a uh, wind speed of, let's say, 10 knots, you will uh, first align or face the winds, then you approach the runway as you check for your center line. The approach will be such, this approach. Then uh, once you are overhead uh, the runway, you will uh, correct, you will uh, maintain your center line and uh, land the aircraft. Effect of rain are we have a low visibility, that's why pilots are required to be high far rated. The second one, we have ice formation since uh, the temperatures are low. Uh, this uh, ice formation will affect the moving parts of uh, the aircraft and uh, also will may create uh, blockages of the, the, the pitots or probes found outside the, the aircraft, which are directly linked to the instrument uh, on board of the aircraft. We also have uh, the standing water on uh, the runway. The standing water will have uh, two effects. The first one is uh, on takeoff and, and the second one is on landing. On takeoff, the, the water, standing water on the runway will uh, cause the distance takeoff run to increase. And uh, on uh, on landings, they will uh, reduce or decrease the brake performance. We also have what you call aquaplaning, which is uh, hope now if your flight is diverted because of rain, you can now understand because of these rations mentioned. 